in my life, I have learned the power of fasting, the breakthrough that fasting accelerates in our lives. And I want to tell you my experiences with it, about it, and what it's done, and and hopefully encourage you to seek the Lord and what that looks like in your life, because fasting is, is a huge piece in our Christian walk that is it adds so much to our life that if we're if that's missing in our life, I want to I want to tell you it's what what seems like you're taking things away from me is actually addition and multiplication in your life. Somebody told me that whole that um, fasting is Holy Spirit pitocin births things faster, right? And so I want to tell you three three reasons for myself why I fast. Three things that I've learned from fasting. And and I'll go through seasons where maybe I'll fast for a week or I'll fast once a week or it looks different. And I just seek the Lord on that because I want, I want to know like, okay, Lord, what do you have grace for me in this season? What are you asking me to do? Um, and, and, and I want to encourage you to do that. And I even ask them, what should I fast? Sometimes, a lot of times I'll do a Daniel fast or a water fast. Um, and so I want to like talk about what that's looked like in my life. And the three, the three things that I've learned from fasting. The first one is I have learned self-control more than I ever have in my life, right? It, it's, fasting brings a level of self-control and breakthrough <laughs> that you will not have seen before. The second thing is I, uh, through fasting, I, you, you, there's just such an intimacy, such a direct connection with the Father where you're like, I'm going to forsake my flesh and I'm going to draw closer to you. Like James 4, 8, draw nigh to me and I will draw nigh to you. That There is a closeness that, that we see. And a lot of times when I, I'll, I'll fast, if there's a big decision I need to make or there's something I'm asking the Lord for, a lot of times I'll fast. And as I'm fasting, I'll get from the Lord. Okay, Lord, how long? What am I fasting? And I'll, 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 do, I'll be in that time and I'll, and I'll pursue him. And at the end of that fast is usually, and this is the third thing, is usually it's at the end of the fast that I see what the what the answer. I see the, the, what he's showing me, what I've been praying for is it brings acceleration in your life. And so I want to encourage you, ask the Lord today, Father, what does it look like for me to fast? What what would you have me fast? It could be social media. It could be Netflix. It could be um, your phone. It could be reading a book. Like it can be good things too, you know, that maybe we've put in place of the Lord. But whenever there's just something about fasting, when f- fasting food, that man, you're really denying your flesh, Sarah. But whatever that looks like for you, I encourage you and I empower you, I challenge you, ask the Lord today what that looks like. Lord, we thank you for all the things that you have given us and the tools that you've given us in that fasting is one of those things that we get to we get to pursue breakthrough. We get to pursue you. We get to draw closer to you. And so I just pray right now that you just show people what that looks like in their lives, Father. In Jesus' name, amen.